Do you guys see that? It's very bright out here. So let's go in the biggest Dollar Tree in the USA. Alright you guys, we're gonna do a shop with me. We're gonna go inside, hang out. Kira is in the car. She's gonna come in with me and we're on the hunt for the lemon stuff.
you guys like for real I just looked all over like this is the only one I see for wine glasses like I might cry like I almost dropped it Kira told me to calm down she did she said calm down calm down I don't see the glasses though I just see the wine glass so we're gonna keep looking Lots of cherries, you guys, lots of cherries. But only the coffee cups, the bowls, wine glasses, and there was only two placemats. So, got two of everything I could. Oh, okay. So. so, that shop with me was cut short. Um, I don't know if I stopped recording before we were asked to not record, if I got that in camera or not, but one of the employees came up to us shortly after we came in the store. We weren't in there for very long. There was still a ton of store left and said we do not allow media filming in this store and I was like what for real and then so I was like okay thinking you know the camera so then we went a little bit further in and I started using my phone I wasn't talking this was just a shop with me I just you know speeding it up a little bit with music um, so I was using my phone and then over the intercom another employee was like security please scan the store and I was like dang they're for real so I'm super bummed that I didn't get a lot of footage in there because it's definitely an awesome store they had a huge snack zone my store does not have a snack zone they had a lot of new food items that I'd never seen before so what I'm gonna do because I was so excited to share this like super long shop with me with you guys is I am checking out a couple other Dollar Trees on the way back because this was a two-hour drive for Kira and I so we're checking out a couple other stores and I am going to share my haul with you guys right now well not right now for me but when we get back to Kira's house I'm gonna share my haul okay I know I said the haul was gonna be at Kira's house but we just ran out of time for me to film so I'm back at home now I actually had to mail some boxes for me I was hoping to get this video up like the first thing this week but better late than never right guys so You've already seen the shop with me and how that turned out. I was really disappointed that I wasn't able to share the entire store with you because it was massive. Like it was a huge store. 
and I feel like the second we were told that we couldn't film, it just left a bad taste in Kira in my mouth, and we were just like, okay, well, I don't even want to shop here now. So I picked up a few things because I was able to find most of the lemon stuff there, so we went ahead and bought that. And then we went to a ton of other Dollar Trees because I was still on the hunt for those plates. So I'm going to show you guys everything that I picked up at all the Dollar Trees. I was pretty good knowing that I was flying back home. If I was driving, I would have bought a lot more. You guys go watch Kira's haul. I'll have it linked down below. She's already posted her haul from all the Dollar Trees that we went to. But I'm going to share with you guys what I got on vacation, plus I got a ton of stuff at a Target dollar spot. I have never been to a Target dollar spot in a different state before, and this one had my name all over it. So Dollar Tree first, I was able to find some of the lemon stuff. I was actually able to find everything but the plates. Now, I don't know. You guys let me know if you've seen the lemon stuff. Do they have the oven mitts? Do they have the chair cushions? Like with the fall stuff they're bringing out, the sunflowers, they have a ton of stuff in that print. But this was everything I saw in the lemon. So I did get two of everything. I really would like six of everything, but again, knowing I wasn't driving home, I was flying, I kind of limited myself. So I'm still, fingers crossed, that the lemon stuff comes to my area. If not, no big deal. So I got two of the dish towels. I am just in love with this print, you guys. It is so pretty and very year-round. This is not, this doesn't just necessarily scream summer to me, it just screams kitchen. So I got two of the dish towels. I did get two of the placemats. I should have got six, but these were the only two, like they only had two. I really wanted six, but again, maybe I will find them. If not, oh well, I could use these for like the head of the table, the two chairs. Then I got two of the coffee cups. How cute. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. I am just in love. I'm in love. I cannot wait. Cannot wait for us to build our forever home and just to really start decorating. I'm super excited. I got two of the bowls, two of the wine glasses, and I think these are my favorite. I really love the drinking glasses. They're so pretty. I just think they look beautiful with the lemons on them. So that's all the lemon stuff I found. Now, I did have a friend reach out and she actually called me and said, hey, I'm in my Dollar Tree right now. I see the plates. They have the plates. So I was like, oh my gosh, I love you so much. So she actually picked up two of the big plates and two of the little plates. So oh, again, keep those fingers crossed that they make it in the mail. I'm sure she's going to package it up really, really good for me, but you never know how rough they are with boxes sometimes. So I'm keeping my fingers crossed that they make it to me in one piece and I will post it on Instagram when I get those and I finally have my complete collection. So like I said, I did pick up some other stuff to come home with. I have not seen these in my Dollar Tree yet and I thought they were super cute. I was really on the hunt for this one, the white and wood looking chevron. And then I picked up this one just because I love the colors on it. I thought that was super cute. Okay, I own three of these already, and these are kind of on the bigger side, so I was really pushing it getting these. I had to mail myself home two boxes because I got all this stuff, but I really was afraid that I wouldn't find them in these colors at my house because now they're already pulling fall stuff out, and I don't know if they're going to keep these colors through like the school season, organizing, and all of that. So I went ahead and picked two of these, but I absolutely love these. In my kitchen like I said I have three of them already and they're just little veggie storage baskets I have a purple one that I use for blueberries I have a red one that I use for strawberries and I don't remember what the other one is I think I have like a green one that I've used for grapes so I went ahead and got two more because you can use them for veggies also not just fruits so like cucumbers carrots that kind of thing but I love the size and they fit perfectly in my refrigerator and they stack well also all right, I did end up getting a candle. I don't know about the throw of these ones, but this is lemon poppy, and it just smells really good. Like, I'm not a big fan of the cupcake, cupcake topper. I'll just have it sitting out like this, but again, I just love that lemon scent. All right, I got some stuff down the makeup aisle. So 
I got a nail file because I thought I was gonna need it and I never ended up using it, so that's okay. This is a fashion nail file with case, which is really cool. Um, it comes with two nail files and then it has the case, so I'll just stick this with my luggage and I'll have it for next time. Then I got these. I have never seen these before and at my Dollar Tree, I've heard of them and I always wanted to give them a try. So again, this is just gonna be something that I keep with my luggage to take with me. And it is a two pack of the Crest with Scope mini brush. It says no water needed, breath freshener, Crest clean meets scope freshness. So I thought that was cool just to have on hand. One pack of nails, I think I did pretty good. I'm pretty set on nails, I have a lot of them. I have three of those little cases full of nails. But I just loved how pretty these were. It's kind of a French manicure, but on top of the white, it has these little pink floral designs on it. And then I picked this up. Now, I just noticed, like just noticed. I thought this was a lip gloss. I thought the, per the color was pretty. It said pink lemonade. I was like, oh, that's cute. However, now that I'm reading it, it says shimmering facial whip. Perfect for highlighting. I am no professional when it comes to makeup. I kind of just put it on probably the wrong way, just whatever I think works and looks okay. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to use this as a, like a highlighter. It says highlights eyes, lips, and cheeks. So I guess you could use this on your lips. I don't know. You guys let me know if you have picked this up and how you think it works. All right, I have quite a few food items here. First one, this one is smushed all up because of how it was packed. But I know my daughter, my oldest daughter Paige is gonna love it. This is Rice Krispie Treats and it's cookies and cream. So it has three bars in here. They're individually wrapped, they're 100 calories each. And she just loves Rice Krispies and we hardly ever do Rice Krispies, only really around holidays. So like I said, I just saw these and I thought that would be just a cute little surprise for her. Um, my younger kids, her siblings, are making her like a little basket of like her favorite snacks because her birthday is coming up and I thought that would be something cute for her siblings to give to her. So she's almost 14, oh my goodness, like on Monday. Monday is her birthday, July 2nd. She's gonna be 14 years old. So I picked this up for them to put in her little gift bag. Speaking of the little kids, I saw these and I know they are going to get a kick out of them. I think they're really gonna enjoy these. These are Biscolata on the go and it says mood. There's like little emojis and prints all over them. And what they are is cookies filled with milk chocolate cream. It says two servings per container, 150 calories in about 12 cookies. So I think they're going to enjoy these little itty bitty things. Then I saw these, you guys. So Dollar Tree has this new thing that some of them are getting. Mine hasn't gotten it yet. I think it's called the Snack Zone. So in the Snack Zone, they had these individually wrapped, a dollar a piece. But then in the food aisle at the largest Dollar Tree that we went to, they had a box of them for a dollar. The same price for a box. And then if you want it individually, one dollar for one. I thought that was crazy. And there's six bars in here. So if you bought that separately, it'd be $6 versus a dollar. I mean, which one are you gonna do? So I got this, I thought that was cool, I've never seen it before. They are breakfast squares, soft baked bars, baked apple cinnamon. This was the only flavor that I saw. I'm sure they have other ones. I don't know if they're at the Dollar Tree, but I went ahead and picked these up. Then I got some mixes. So first up, these are all by Swanson and they are homemade soup makers. So I got a vegetable beef noodle cooks in about 30 minutes, makes about eight cups of soup. So perfect for my family of six with like a side salad and maybe some breadsticks. I thought this would be a quick and easy dinner. You do need to add ground beef, diced tomatoes, and some beef broth, but I thought this was just a really cool thing to have on hand. And these are, all three of these are soup makers. So this one is chicken noodle soup. You have to add chicken, diced carrots, and chicken broth. And then this one is loaded potato. You add bacon, potato, heavy cream, and chicken broth. Now these ones, I'm not sure about, but I just love having this kind of thing on hand. We'll see. Um, this is all for seafood. These are three different seafood cooking sauces. So half of my family likes seafood, the other half not so much. But I figured these would be good to have on hand just to try out. So this one is a spicy lemon dill. Then we've got a tomato, garlic, and wine. 
and this one I'm excited about. This one is Curry Thai Basil, and it shows it on shrimp. So these two, it shows it on fish, but I'm sure you could use it on whatever you want. Last of the food, these have been on my wish list for a while, um, and I think I saw somebody haul them in a different brand, but whatever. I was still just looking for the pickle flavored sunflower seeds. My husband has been on a sunflower seed kick lately, and he likes pickles, so I thought this would be interesting for him to try. It's by Biggs Vlasic, which is a name brand. No artificial colors or preservatives, and it's just dill pickle sunflower seeds. Alright guys, so I did get one thing for a friend. She was looking for the cactus feather pen, so I'm glad I could find that, and that's going to go in some friend mail. Then, thinking ahead, <laughs> I picked up these. So this is a relatively new print that is out at the Dollar Tree. They have notebooks and list pads and all sorts of stuff. I got two packages of the sticky notes. They are by Crown Jewels. There are 50 in each one. And on it, it says Love Notes, and it looks like little splotches of watercolor paint all around it. So I got two of these because I thought I would do something cute with this during Valentine's Day, which is in February, for next year, either in my kids' lunch boxes or maybe leaving it on their door. I did something very similar this past Valentine's Day, but that's just what came to mind when I read the love notes and saw the little sticky pads. Then I had to pick this up. You guys, I'm going to be holding on to this for a very long time. <laughs> I love the succulents. I think they are super pretty. I'm on the hunt for the cacti one. It has tons of different cacti prints on it. It might have a couple succulents or flowers mixed in there, but Nicole Burgess recently mentioned that she was redoing her laundry room and she had them kind of on her washer and dryer. And I thought that was such a cute idea to use wall stickers on your appliances. So I'm looking for that one. I'm glad to find this one, but I'm really, I don't plan on using these until we move out into our home that we're building, which isn't even gonna be for about two years. But with the Dollar Tree, you never know when they're going to get rid of it entirely. So you got to grab it when you can. Then I got some stuff for my kiddos. So I did get some more wall stickers. I got these for my girls, Moana. They really love this movie. So I thought they could decorate their room in the shop that we're going to be living in uh, just to make it feel a little bit more homey while we're there. Also found this coloring book. My kids love The Lion Guard. They love The Lion King. They love Disney in general. So I thought this would be fun for them to color. And then I'm excited to do this with the kids. I think this is going to be fun. It's paper airplanes. How many does it have in here? It says eight paper airplanes, one landing strip, and one instruction sheet. So I think this is going to be fun. All right, you guys. That was everything that I picked up from the Dollar Trees that I went to. That's a couple different stores. Everything that I picked up in another state. Actually, this is like from four different states. Three different states, both Carolinas, Alabama, Georgia, four different states. I think I did pretty good for going into several Dollar Trees in four different states, and that's all I came home with. But then I also went to Target, so I'm going to show you guys everything that I got at Target. First things first, I actually, Nicole Burgess picked these up for me because they have not been at my Target, and I just had her pick up one of each. I didn't want her to go crazy or anything like that, however, I do have something planned for them. So when I saw them, I was like, okay, I'm going to grab one more of each. So now I have a set of two of both of these, and they are just little ceramic lemons. So this one is a full lemon, and this one is one cut in half. You guys are going to see a theme, too. Then I saw these plates. It, they were a dollar for six plates. I was really hoping to find more, but this was the last one. Like, there was no more. So I went ahead and picked this up got a little package of balloons and there are eight in here and I'm pretty sure they spell out lemonade I think it kind of makes it look like that on the picture here so this was the only thing that was not in the dollar spot I actually saw these cups just hanging out in the middle of an aisle as we were walking around Target they were two dollars there's 12 cups in here and it has a lime and a lemon on it. The lemon's kind of covered by the sticker right here. Sticking with the cups, I did get a lot of cups. I have something in mind for these for next year. So these ones are smaller. Does it tell me? They're seven ounces. It was a dollar each. 
There are 12 in here and it just says fresh lemonade with just a white background. I got two of those. And then these ones are bigger. These ones are 12 ounces. There's eight in here and it says easy peasy lemon squeezy with the light blue mint colored background. Like what? I had to get this. It says fresh lemonade. Can you guys even see that? But it says fresh lemonade. I had to pick this picture up. I just had to do it. And then I found this. How cute. I cannot wait to start decorating my office. Like for real. I'm so excited. So this is just, they had a couple different versions. They had a white crate. They had a pink crate. I just love this basic looking one with the white lettering on it. And this was $3 got some little baggies. I have something in mind for these in the future. And these say easy peasy lemon squeezy. They were a dollar. And each one has how many? Does it tell me? Uh, 20. Each one has 20 bags in here. Got some reusable ice cubes. And of course, these look like little lemon slices. There are 12 in here. And it was a dollar. Got a tablecloth. This is just white and yellow stripes all over it. It is 108 inches by 54 inches and it was three dollars. Got some napkins. I got two of each kind that I found so I'll show you one of each. They were each a dollar and there are 10 in each one. So this pink one says fresh lemonade. This one says when life gives you lemons make lemonade. And this one says easy peasy lemon squeezy. I got two different kinds of chalkboards. This one is actually a stand, has a little stand on here and it says personalize me, works best with colored chalk, chalkboard easel, and it was $3. And of course you can see there, it looks like a lemon. And then this one is also an easel or you could easily add your own hardware to hang it up if you wanted to. And this one says fresh lemonade. It was $3 also. I love that this is the actual black chalkboard and it's got the colored lettering right there. I got some banners. So these were each $3. This one is slices. Looks like a lemon slice. However, there's different colors. There's an orange one, there's a green one, there's yellow and pink. So it could be an orange slice or a lemon slice or a lime slice, something like that. But I thought it was really cute. And then this one is just the, like a hard cardboard banner, also $3 and it says lemonade when you pull it all out. That's what it spells. I got a sign that says fresh lemonade. This is a small apron. I think it would fit me. I don't know until I open it up, but it just says apron one piece. It says fresh lemonade on it. It has a little pocket with a lemon on it. Let's see if I can get close enough for you guys to see that. And this was $3. <sighs> this was definitely my favorite find at the Target Dollar Spot. I think this is a great deal. These are huge cups. I was hoping it would tell me there's four of them in here. Do not microwave, not dishwasher safe, hand wash, which is totally fine because we're not even going to have a dishwasher in our tiny home slash shop, shop while we're building. But this was $3 for four of these cups. And I'm going to go ahead and open it up because I want you guys to see, like, these are heavy duty, heavy duty cups. Like, that's really big. Look at that. And it's super thick, thick plastic. I love it. So I got one of each color that I found. So again, $3 for four cups. I got the yellow ones. I got these blue ones. And then I got these green ones, like for real. $9 for 12 cups. I think that was a really good deal. All right, you guys, so that was my haul. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Let me know if you've ever been asked not to film in a store. Like seriously, I was super disappointed, but oh well, at least I found the majority of the lemon stuff. Finally, I had to travel lots and lots of miles away from home to find them, but I found them. And one of you guys, if you are here, is so graciously, so graciously reached out to me, said they found them, and they're sending the plates. So yay, thank you so much. But if you guys like this type of video, give it a big thumbs up and maybe when I'm out shopping, I'll try to do more shop with me's and my hauls if you guys like that kind of thing. If you are new, I would love for you to subscribe and stick around and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.